Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be a wig comparison. It's going to be a comparison of two styles. Let me grab a sip of coffee. Mm. I'm going to be comparing this Jackson by Norico, and this is in Champagne Rooted, average cap. Absolutely beautiful. I love this style. Out of the three styles Miss Denise sent to me, to try on and review for you guys. I like this one the best is Jackson. The other two were just kind of too short, it seemed. But this, I love how this frames my face. Um, so this is Jackson in Champagne Rooted. But when I first put it on, it reminded me of something else. And I was like, what does this remind me of? It reminded me of my Misty. And this is from Polly Young. And she needs to be calmed out. But this is Misty from Polly Young. And it just kind of reminded me of Misty. Now, there, there are some differences. This one is a lot longer. But if you like this style, but you want to go a little shorter, you may like Misty. And I believe Misty is a little more affordable. Okay, so here is what Jackson looks like. She has a little bit of length to her. I do have a full review on her with all of her information. I'll leave that linked up above. And I do have on a wig cap since this is not my wig. This was um, very graciously, kindly sent to me to try on um, and see if I liked the style. And I do. <laughs> I do. I do like the style. So this is, and I'm going to put her back in her bag. So I do not mess her up in any way, shape, or form. I'm just going to slip her back in there right now. I want to show you Misty. Now for Misty, I can take this off because Misty is mine. And I was wearing that for sanitary reasons on all my reviews because those were not my wigs and I wanted to keep them clean and sanitary. So this is Misty. Actually, give me, give me that back. I'm going to hold them up side by side. So you guys can see. So obviously Jackson is longer. Has a longer nape in the back. What really got me was the, the top and the front. Now if you see the top, almost identical on kind of the way they're rooted. And like the way this bang hangs. Now Misty does have a shorter bang. She has a shorter side fringe. She has a shorter nape. So if you like Jackson, but you kind of want something a little bit shorter. So let's try on Misty. Lay there so you don't fall down. Now I've had Misty a while. And as you can see, because she's got hairs coming out, I need to try to poke these boogers back through. Um... And I have extended her about an inch. I do have a video on how to do that. I will leave it linked up above as well. Because she is an average cat. But now she goes on with ease. I might could actually even tighten her up a little bit. Because where I've worn her, this is my most worn wig. Um, she has stretched out even more. So she she goes on very easily now. And since I've colored my hair, I can pull a little bit of this out. And not my bangs, because my bangs are too long. But this side a little bit here, like all up in this side, I can pull that out. Get here where you can see. I do have an unboxing and a review on Misty way back i'll leave her linked up above as well this is a very affordable Polly young is affordable all the way around i think this wig was under 80 dollars, and that was with shipping i'm pretty sure this is my most worn style um 
The fringe on Jackson comes, as you saw, to my jawline. This comes to just below my cheekbone. The nape is obviously shorter. The bang is shorter. It comes just below or to my cheekbone, below the eyes. But it stays out of my face, and that's one reason I really like the style. And I have parted her on the other side. And it does fine. <laughs> I have parted it in the middle, and it does fine. Um, that's one reason I really like this wig, is I have parted it like left, right, center. I've parted it every which direction, and it does fine. But I like to part my hair this way. This is the way my hair naturally parts is here. So... But, yep, this is Paula Young. And then this one is Noriko. Both very pretty. This is Buttered Toast. If you want something a little darker, because this is definitely too blonde for me. Um, I love this style. This will get added to my collection. A Jackson will get added to my collection. But it, it'll be darker than Champagne Rooted. It'll be darker than that. All right, guys, just wanted to give you a quick comparison of a Noriko Jackson to a Polly Young Misty and show you they are very similar in their cut and style and how they lay. And the price points are a little different. This one is more affordable. Um, caps are made pretty much exactly the same, except Polly Young's is an open, kind of an open wifted cap, where is the... Um, Norica cap is a traditional Norica cap. It has the lace on the top and you can definitely feel the permatease in there. You can definitely feel the permatease. And I'll try this one on one more time for you guys. So you can see the difference. This one is a lot more snug. I will give you that. See this fringe? It comes almost to the jawline there, or to the jawline. There's a couple little shorty pieces here that blend in. If you like one, you might want to try the other. So just giving you guys options to try. If you've never tried Noriko, but you wear Polly Young, this might be a style you want to try and vice versa. So just wanted to show you guys. Um, I thought they were very similar. One is just longer than the other. I love it. All right, guys, as always, thanks for watching. Be sure you give this video a thumbs up, hit subscribe. We are almost at 2K, guys. We will be giving away a skincare and makeup goodie box to somebody here in the United States, and I will be giving away a Pandora bracelet to somebody international. So, yeah, that is going to be the giveaway when we hit 2K, and I will have both of these girls' information and links to them down below in the description box if you want to check either one of them out. As always, guys, thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys on the next one.